Yo, 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 what up, MTV? It's your boy, Big Man Tyrone, with another video on MTV. The cameraman want me to show how to be ghetto, but I don't know anybody ghetto than me other than Big Man Tyrone. Let's get started in the video. First off, this is my crib right here. It's not my crib, I stole it from my grandma. She had died the other day for wearing the wrong color. Oh, dang, I got the wrong color. I gotta take this up. Oh, dang. The first day in the streets in the ghetto, you gotta know everybody. That's why I call everybody my cuz. Yo, what up, cuz? Yo, what up, cuz? Yo, cuz. So you know everybody. Not all your brothers, man. You gotta stick together. Unless you're wearing the wrong color. Oh, dang, I'm still wearing the wrong color. Oh, dang. Also, so you earn your ink. I don't got an ink yet, cause I raced it was with marker. But you gotta be from jail, man. I come from every single jail. I know Tom, the police officer, he's such a pig, yo. Such a pig, man. I slapped his I slapped his daughter in the face. He sent me to jail for 24 years for child abuse. Come on, man. You ain't got nobody got time for this shit. I come home every single day, hit my kid three times as hard as that. You ain't gonna put that in the video, right? I can't go back to jail, man. And that's another thing you gotta say. You can't go back to jail. Cause now these cops are shooting, man. They shooting. They shooting like they in the hood. Who taught them that? Well, my favorite words is, I, will, I love to say, damn, girl. I see a girl come by, man, bend over like, damn, you got a trunk in that dun dun dun. Damn, bro, don't drop that dun the dun bro. Come over here with that dun the dun Let me get that up in my dun the dun Let me unlock that truck with my key, bro. Also, I love saying my nick. It's the cameraman. Also, if you get in the fight, if you don't want to, because you, you ain't got a grain on your bone, man. Neither do I, but I, I don't even know. But if you want to fight, but you don't want to fight, you know what I'm saying? You, you got to ask him to hold your stuff back like, like this. Hold my stuff. Hold my stuff. And just and just hassle as hard as you can. Like, this this shirt ain't gonna come off. It's stitched to my back. So nobody can find me because I don't like people grab my shirt and shit. That's it, yeah, man. So uh yeah, that's how you back off thoughts, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's pretty late. Works every time. Education! Yo, he talking about something about education. Come here, boy. Let me tell you something about welfare and relying on the government. Birth control. You stupid, man. You went to school, don't know anything, boy. You can't control my birth. I'm already born. <laughs> oh, you talking about my churn. You ain't gonna talk about my churn that way. But anyways, I left my life a whole month ago. And and then, and then, these, these people keep on coming to me saying, we need to have a DNA test. And I'm like, okay, and I don't know why you need a DNA test because I, I don't got no babies. And he said, well, I'm going to have to see about that. And then we came to the place. He said, you are, you is the father. I was like, I can't be the father. All right, now that you got the style like a ghetto, now I got dressed like one. First off, don't worry about your hair because that'll become bald out of nowhere because you always wear a bandana. Then you got to put your pants down a little all the way down so you're like waddling, you know what I'm saying? Then your shirt. I don't really know. You gotta show them guns, you know what I'm saying? And uh, you gotta walk like this. You gotta grab it like you ain't got no belt, you know what I'm saying? Gotta grab it like you got no belt, bro. Just, just water, water, water like a freaking duck, man. That, that's lit, bro. Also, you gotta have a deep voice because, uh, Cameron, don't tell any of the boys. They make fun of me. This is my real voice. <laughs> Hello, uh, my name is Tyrone, big man Tyrone, and I am from the ghetto. I know, right? Pretty embarrassing. All right, all right. Is you hungry? Of course he is. Boom. Boom. Look. Oh, wait. That, that's my refrigerator. It's also stored for my grandma. But, uh, ooh, ooh, you got Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. You got jam, grape jam, my favorite. I love me some grape. Uh, I just drink it whole, you know what I'm saying? I like to drink grape juice whole. Uh, this jelly, never mind. I like, give me some tea, some sweet tea. My grandma's recipe adding uh, a whole block of sugar. This whole thing right here is sugar. And then, and, uh, and this is all the tea she be adding. Man, the best stuff ever. But honeybees keep on coming over there. They be back up. Then, it's my cousin's birthday. Uh, I stole it from his birthday and he was crying. I, I don't give up. And then, I got some eggs. I got some Coca-Cola. I got some, me some gumbo. 
from my mama. Uh, she gave it to me. And I got the legendary tasting. Watermelon. Let me just get that. Ah, oh. All right, man, we got this watermelon right here. About uh, four to five pounds. And uh, this thing gonna be gone about now. So, you want some? No, you don't. It's mine. The things I love is me some watermelon, some grape soda, Xbox, PS4, and big booty. So, uh, yeah. That's it, the end of the video. Hope y'all guys enjoy. And, uh, subscribe to Amazing Man Jr. for a while, man. He the best, man. He's so lit. He the best man in the neighborhood, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, pretty lit. Yo, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. This video was How to Be Ghetto. I'm doing a whole series. Before I did How to Be Redneck. This episode is How to Be Ghetto. Next one, How to Be Asian. Next one, How to Be Jewish. Next one, How to Be Islamic. And, uh, so on for. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. We didn't get 10 likes on that one. I had super high uh, expectation. I thought you guys were smart enough, but most of these subscribers, I'm thinking they're bots or my friends that subscribe but don't watch my videos, but that's okay. Am I right? A thousand subscribers, still the goal. For this goal, uh, we want five likes, all right? Let's just try super small, five likes, five likes, all right? And uh, let's try to get at least to 50 views, man. I know you guys can do that. All right, so uh, yesterday it was so freaking lit. On my last video on how to be redneck, uh, Cyberbully, of course, as always, saying, you're not redneck, you nigglet, and he didn't want to, you know, say the N-word because uh, he got in trouble with his parents. But uh, anyways, you guys defended me. You guys were like, back off, you stupid bitch, I mean. And he's like, and then Cyberbully, he texted me. He was like, bro, what the heck is going on? I'm like, it's called true fan love. Get used to it. So, guys, thank you for defending me. Thank you for having those nice comments, man. I'm going to have a nice comments video and a bad comments video all for Cyberbully. So, you wanted that. But that's only if this video gets five likes. All right? If this video gets five likes, I'll post the next video tomorrow earlier, okay? Because uh, I didn't get a lot of sleep. Because Cyberbully kept on texting me at like 2 o'clock in the morning saying, What the Jesus is going on? Excuse me for my blasphemy. All right. See you guys later. Oh, stay amazing.